is the, the lovely, the gorgeous, pleasure the is mine. ever beautiful Zoe. You know? Hi, Mark. Hey, how, how you are doing? You? I'm okay. I'm yeah. excited to be here today. Yeah. And obviously, when you're seeing this podcast, watching mm -hmm. this podcast, or listening to this podcast, it's not just us. You know, we got a team. We got man like Amon. We have Nyika. We have Edgar. We have Ayo. <laughs> I like saying Ayo's name. You know, it just gives me the energy that I need. Mm -hmm. You know, how's how's your day been? It has been an up and down. Mm. First of all, I had a walk in the botanical garden so that was botanical the highlight gardens. yes trust Yo. me it was a calm morning mm -hmm. and all of a sudden turned to rain cats and dogs yeah. so i don't know how that all happened but i'm so happy to be here i don't know about you yeah my me i didn't have a walk in the botanical <laughs> gardens <laughs> what but did you I'm do here, in the morning in the morning you know conversation you know somebody called me we were talking mm -hmm. it was raining it was a baby it was talk. a situation i know, you know? <laughs> and i'm here now you know so just know i love this podcast because mm -hmm. i'd be somewhere else you know it's a weather for two and we are here <laughs> you, and, you and this podcast presenting you know mm. yeah man it's been a long time coming you know, shout out Amon. He he's like the proper originator of the whole concept that we have here. We need to talk. You know, he hit us up all individually, and now we're here. We're a whole team. Mm -hmm. And yeah, man, I hope we bring the fire. You know. Do you think? Are you gonna bring the fire? Obviously, I'm bringing it blazing. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, have you ever thought of having a podcast before you got onto this one? Or is this your first ever? I mean, I've been thinking about it. You know, I've been thinking about it. Him and I actually spoke about, you know, all that stuff. I uh, have another homie of mine I was going to do a podcast with. Mm. You know, just about the internet, you know, and what goes viral, what doesn't, you know, what we think should be going viral. Mm. Yeah. But I feel like this is better because we need to talk is a better concept, man. We need to talk about life. Yeah. So we need to talk about Zoe. So who is Zoe? Zoe uh, yeah. is my AK. That's uh, my internet name, I should say. Mm -hmm. And where does it come from? My full name is Zawede. Okay. Zawade. Zawede. Zawede. Mm -hmm. Z a w e w d e. That's a nice name. Thank you. Mm. Uh, so how it gets to become Zoe? Uh, I went to school. That was senior one. And of course, I introduced myself as Patricia because that's my first name. However, Patricia Zawede. Yes, mm -hmm. we had over thirty Patricias in like senior oh one. Oh my god! Yes, it's like a hundred marks. <laughs> <laughs> so at, at that point, I was like, "No way, I'm getting into this." Mm -hmm. When they asked me to introduce myself, obviously rolled with my surname, and with time, people started cutting it uh, to Zawi. I don't want to say it, but uh, with that kind of chat that came up, that's yeah. how I became a Zoe. Yeah. So most people uh, ask how, I mean, this generation and I have a name of the like the youngins because yeah. this current situation. So you wouldn't categorize yourself as a youngin? Mm, I do not know. I don't want to, see, yeah. to speak about that. I'm a woman, <laughs> of course. I'm never young. Yeah. But that's it. Uh, who am I and what do I do? Um. I'm an influencer, AK. Uh, sometimes people call me an influencer and I get mad because of the way people in Uganda uh, associate brand. or term or brand yeah. influencers. But I hope at a certain point we shall be at a better stand where we shall all feel proud about it. Yeah. And then I'm an accountant. That's a, a side hustle. I do it at a low. Accountant. Yeah, because yes. unfortunately, <laughs> um, ac accounting is that profession people look at and they admire, but the real situation in there is not happy. It's so, different. yeah, um, different you, from have what to, see. you have to be so patient to climb yeah. the ladders. Uh, you have to give it in your all, and uh, you do not get the time and the pleasure to do other things when you're yeah. there. So, it's something I can't take on because I don't like to be kept in one corner yeah. for, for long. Then thirdly, your mental has to be strong, yes. you know, and that's what we're talking about on this podcast as mm. well, mental health. Then uh, currently what takes uh, most of my time at yeah. the moment, I'm a client service with different uh, clients. So I'm always interacting with very, very many people, different categories. Today it could be a lawyer, tomorrow it could be a doctor the next day. So yeah, that's it. It's always learning in my life. 
So you're always interacting with people. Yes, I, ha- with I have to people, make sure that client is happy and have to make sure whoever has to deliver whatever they're delivering to that yeah, client man, is I doing it in the you. best way. I understand way. So you because... Some days are happy days. Some days I'm being blown off by clients yeah. and I have to stay calm. I'm happy. I have to be... And you know what's, yeah. what's hard is if you're representing someone that doesn't, that's like... Never delivers. Yeah. yeah. I've, yeah. I've been there, but you have to learn how to neutralize the situation yeah, you all look, the time. You look like it's you that's just not delivering. Yet you're representing Obviously, a company or a Obviously, so you have to take the blows. Yeah. And then finally, uh, this is a new thing. I don't mm-hmm. know what they call for who be on podcasts. So I think there is a name <laughs> out there that I don't know. Maybe you yeah. can tell me about it. Hosts. Yeah, I this is hosts, something right? I never imagined myself doing. Podcasters. So thank you, Eamon, for giving me this chance and opportunity to be here. I did not ever envision my voice um, or people listening to me or having conversations. But since it's a fun and exciting thing, yeah, and I have, of course, the best co-host, mm. I'm sure it's going to be amazing. Yeah, man. Yeah. We'd love so, to see it. We'd love to briefly, hear it. That's me. And I'm ready to listen. To me. Tell me about <laughs> you. <laughs> Jim, mm-hmm. acronym for Create History in My Presence. So very many people hit me up and like, yo, what does chimp mean? You know, what's chimp? Long story short, product of racism, you know, in high school from one of my best friends, you know. But yeah, I took it on. I made it cool. And I actually made an acronym that everybody loves and knows me by. And we're here now, you know. We made humor out of a situation. We made it. (laughs) (laughs) You know, we made it. Mm. Uh, Radio, television host, uh, what else, man? Actor, uh, wow. videographer. Where do we find um, your movies? I've acted in a series. You For know? example, we are series. excited to find out. I'm not about to start talking see. about that big corporation. You should tell us. But we yeah, want to see on the screen. It was, it was called Power of Legacy. Mm-hmm. You know, it was called um, Power of Legacy. I think I've heard about that. Yeah, I was on there. I was a supporting. I, I had a supporting role. You know. Mm. Yeah, I was a young. Trust me, I will be back I was here a young describing guy in and talking about how you did it. <laughs> God, you can, you, I'm pretty sure it's on the internet, mm-hmm. so you guys can go and watch it. You know, mm. yeah, man, uh, I've done a lot of stuff when it comes to the visual arts and performing arts and all of that kind of stuff. Mm. Right now, I'm a pro- cardinal producer. I do programming as well for radio. Um, yeah, man, we keep on pushing the wagon. Before we so go we for a nice haircut. <laughs> Asante, Asante, uh-huh. Asante. Shout mm-hmm. out my, shout out my baba. It's called Mugeni, you know. Is he affordable? Yeah. <laughs> I want to take that. I want, I want oh, to pay. So you're taking me there. No, not you specifically. Yeah. But there is someone I want to. Yeah, you want take to take someone for a haircut. For a haircut. Yeah. I mean, Mugeni knows how to, you know, Do make your things. hairline survive. <laughs> Does he use a compass and a protractor? <laughs> yeah, man. You know what? I was actually looking at dreads like Nyaika, cause man, my hairline had given up, bro. <laughs> I was like, you know what will cover it? It's dreads, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but he's, he, I survived, man. I'm a survivor. My hairline looking sharp, mm-hmm. you know? Going through the ages. Yeah, yeah. But the haircut is like three weeks old. So I need to really go and visit that guy. Okay. The next time I'm here, you guys are going to see a sharp lineup. We are waiting. You know, straighter than happening. your gender. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that one there. Yeah, uh, so that's Chimp. And I'm glad to be here. You know, new experiences. I'm all for it. And uh, yeah, man. So we need to talk. We have this uh, jar. I don't know if it's a jar, a mug, a cup. It's a tin. Yeah, this yeah. tin. You know, and we're going to be picking uh, the papers in the, you know, that have just been jumbled up. Let me fire you first. We're asking ourselves the questions, you know, Mm. asking each other the questions. So you go first. Don't tremble. (laughs) I got you. You, I hope these questions are kawaii. I hope so. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, Chimp. Yeah. How do you plan to approach controversial topics? Such as the cost of healthcare or the impact of financial inequality on oh, health yes, 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 yes. in read, our country, you have Uganda. To read that question again. <laughs> <laughs> I repeat it and go slow on it, right? Oh, oh my God. Okay, let, let me even That's give you question. let me give you a background. Yeah. Um, we've had rounds on social media. Yeah. Okay, at the point and people. Uh, giving uh, their experiences in regards to our fine uh, health, health sector. sector. Um, first of all, accessibility to the costs are mad. Yeah, above. if if you, if you don't have it, yeah, you're either going to live with that disease, 
or you're not going to get helped or you just live on God's masses yeah. or whichever you believe in. Yeah. And uh, people are crying out for help. Mm-hmm. So the question goes, how, would you how do you plan it? you as chimp? Yeah. Or if I came to you and I have a question in regards to that, mm. how do you plan to respond? Or how would you handle such a topic? Okay, not specifically that, but any yeah. topic that's controversial. I mean, I, I really think it it begins with us, you mm-hmm. know. If we do our best to do our best, you know, the people that we do elect will also do their best to do their best and we'll have a proper system of people doing the right thing, mm-hmm. you know. And just like that, voila. That's <laughs> me, I just What's believe voila? I do my best, uh-huh. you know. And people see maybe replicate or also, you know, raise the bar for them to do their best. Yeah, whoever is representing us will just be the guy, you know. I was a good day. You <laughs> rotated and rotated like, to like give the answer. Zoe, political messiah, but if, it's okay, uh-huh. Like if Zoe, <laughs> as an influencer, yeah. right? Mm. You know that branded influencers in a bunch of different ways, uh-huh, right? Yeah. But as an influencer, if Zoe did her best to do her best mm. and to always have the content on time, give the client everything the client needs, right? You're doing your best, you know? Lyrical You're content. raising the bar. Again. Everybody else in that domain mm-hmm. is going to be like, you know what? We can't be slacking. We have to be packing, you know? So you've influenced yeah. everybody else to do the same thing, <laughs> you know? And just like that, because we have done our best, whoever is going to represent us mm-hmm. will have to do their best. All right. So yeah. you're representing, at the moment, you're representing. Yeah. So you're going to do your best. I'm going to do my best. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know? I, I, I had to make sure I, I bring you back best. here to pull you it know? out of you. But yeah, also the people who allow me to represent them, uh-huh. you have to be doing your best. That way, you have the money if things are expensive. So I'm not I'm guy. You know? You're trying so much to avoid the yeah. wall. Okay. Are you ready for your question? Very ready. Okay. Yeah. yeah but these questions are hard. <laughs> you guys, you guys, you guys have come for us. A lot of English. A lot of English, <laughs> man. Uh, why do we need to talk? Okay. Yeah, that's one. Yes. There are two questions on here. So why do we need to we talk? We can break them down. <laughs> okay, but first read the second yeah. one. Uh, uh-huh. What are the goals for this podcast that you want to achieve? Ah, yeah. <laughs> so fast. Fire! All right. <laughs> so fast, why do we need to talk? Yeah, why do we need to talk? Sorry. Chimp, uh, let me put it back in real life scenario. Yeah. As I sit Mm -hmm. here on this mic, I believe I'm talking for people. Yeah. I'm talking for, yeah. Yeah. People who have different things going on in their lives. That's why it's an open mic. Like, we we pick on different topics, you know? We, We are not saying we are only in this direction. Yeah. It's, it's an open session or mm-hmm. conversation. And I think um, that's why that's why they got the both of us because you said you sp- you're speaking for the people. Yeah. Me, I'm speaking to the people. So we're All speaking right. for and to the people, yeah. you know? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so I, I have it in mind that there are people who go through things and they can't talk about them. Yeah. But when I sit here and I hint or oh, unveil those various situations... Or scenarios. Yeah. I'm literally talking about what someone has sitting on their heart. Yeah. Or at the back of their mind. Or someone is going through a situation and they need to hear someone yeah. out there to so encourage them on and know to m- help them move on. It could be a solution. Someone is uh trying to find out probably how to book an A, B and B. Yeah. And a hint on it. Yeah. Or someone is going through a rough time with their bosses at work and they want to find out how do others deal with it. And then yes. a hint on it. And uh, I mean, we need to talk. I believe at certain scenarios, we shall be having Q&As from different people. They'll be telling us or they'll be asking us and we shall be getting answers sometimes from our, our listeners or yeah. people who'll be joining in. And... Yes. Mm, that's why we need to talk. Yes, that's why we need to talk. And there is a lot going on in this country. Mm. There is a lot going on. Bombastic side eye. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> there is a lot going on. Trust me. For example, why is it raining from morning till now? Yeah. We need to talk. We need to talk yeah. about that. Yeah. You know, uh, so yeah. What are the goals for this podcast that you want to achieve? You know? One, I need to be a life-changing 
type of podcast. Yeah, it's okay. um, it's um, you know, uh, people will say you're putting your expectations too high. Yeah, we are doing something like that, but uh, yeah, what do we live for? We live for the experiences. We live for the achievements and for the hard work, and we try to push each day. So if I set the goal and I feel like on this podcast, I want to change someone's life out there. In a way, I may never know, but I know I'll try as much as I can. Yeah. That's one. Two, we need to talk. Yeah. Ask me. Find out. Learn. and learn. Relearn. Relearn. Mm, nice. Oof, motivation, why <laughs> not? <laughs> That's the way to go. So, it's yeah. daily experiences. It could be someone's guide through the day, yeah. through a moment. It could be a fun thing for you. You're yeah. like, out there, if I don't listen to We Need you're to Talk. You're chilling like a villain. You're like, you know what? Yes. Let me just listen to We Need to Talk because these guys are going to up my energy mm. talking about things that, you know, I resonate and with. And of course... We are trendsetters, yeah, so one let's time. watch the space and one see time, how it rolls. Time. Next question. Yep, 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 I'm yep, ready. yep. No cheating. <laughs> I'm ready. Yeah, but man, you guys put in a lot of English in these questions, eh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Chimp. Let's go. Let's go. Who I'm motivates ready. you? Who mo- let me, no, that's not the question. Okay. That's off my head. I want off to start the from there. Yeah. Who motivates you? Who, oh, who is your inspiration? Who is my inspiration? Yeah. Who ah. do you look up to? You know, uh, the same as Elon Musk. Oh, wow. Kanye West. Oh. <laughs> Kanye West. <laughs> now I guess where the lyrical content comes Kanye from. Kanye West. No, it's, it's mad. It's mad. Because uh, he's the greatest artist resting all alive, you know. Everything says that, you know. Mm. But yeah, man, in this domain, this thing that I do, uh just want to shout out Rudy, shout out Marcus, shout out JK Kazora, mm. shout out uh, Morris Mugisha, shout out uh, Roger Mugisha. Because mm. those guys, you know, they found a way of blending the corporate and the entertainment and putting it out there, you know. So shout out to those guys. Those guys actually put the pedestal. You know, they really raised it. They raised yeah, they raised the bar up there. They set the form. Exactly. Like what they I gave said, you a trend. if you do the best that you can do, mm. the next person is going to want to top that. Yeah. You know? Okay. So, yeah. so our question is, are there any particular experts or guests that you expect on this show? And particular why? experts or guests? Mm. Yeah, definitely. We need... Are there any particular yes. experts? Nga, you or, feel that person is on your heart. You want to sit them down and <laughs> ask them and you tell them we yeah. need to talk about this. Experts. One. Uh-huh. I'm on. <laughs> you need to tell us about coffee. I know. <laughs> Two. Nyaika. We need, need to learn about how you... Tell us about you know, the camera and behind the camera. Cameras, how you that. deal with those clients yeah. who ask for work. Exactly. Clients who don't want to pay after you finish the whole exactly. load of work. Yeah. Three Amon. Uh-huh. You know? Hey, I said Amon already. Edgar. Three Ayo. <laughs> Ayo has to talk to us about how the whole DJing thing goes, you know? I want the to know how he affords happens, you know? these machines. All these machines. Or how he nice makes studio. sure he's having the right thing put together to yeah. make sure everything is coming out right. Edgar, life of a freelancer. Mm-hmm. You know, we need to learn. What do you do on days out. when you don't have the gigs running in? Exactly. You People like Rudy. how you survive. People like Rudy. Mm-hmm. Rudende. Mm-hmm. We need to hear you out, man. Tell us, you know, how your journey has been. You know, being one of the top radio hosts in this generation, in the past 10 years, in the past decade, you know, people like, hey, man, I have, I've, I've said, I think I've said everything, right? Yeah. <laughs> I've said everything. Everybody in the room, yeah. plus the one that's not in the room, uh-huh. you know? Yeah. That's, that's one of the experts I'd, I'd want to have on this podcast. Right. Yeah. We look forward. Mm-hmm. I hope and pray one day we have all those guys on here. Yeah. And I know it will happen. So the question was in particular. Yeah, and why? And why? I think you started with a why, right? Yeah, okay. I said I said the names and the why. Mm. Yeah. Okay. All right. You can go People ahead. Good. Yeah, me, I'm going to be just killing these questions, man. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready. You didn't go through the rain I'm for nothing. Ready. No, man, we didn't. Bro, we're not here to play games. Hello? Mm. If you had unlimited money, eh? That That's first a statement. Trap. That's a if trap. you had unlimited money to start your own business, mm. 
<laughs> if you had unlimited money to start your own business, mm. what would it be? Ah, so uh, before you even before you even go far, is an accountant. As 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 we started this podcast, <laughs> so, there is yeah. that bit I didn't talk about. Uh, but anyway, yeah, you're you've, a business lady. You've pushed me to now. You've pinched me. Let yeah. me let me tell you about it. I mean, so yeah. uh, just um, three weeks back. Yeah. I opened up my own. Hey, I thought you were going to say I had unlimited money. No. <laughs> Uh, three weeks back, I started my interior design yeah. company. Oh. Uh, yeah, this is uh, an idea I had for the past so one I want and a half years. This question again. Yes. Unlimited yes, money. Yes. Yes. Like you yes. have Elon Musk yes, bank account. Yes. Okay. And we are going to. We are going, going to listen. Yeah. All or right. You're going to know why. All right. I've had thoughts. Yeah. I have a vision. Yeah. There is somewhere I want to stand at a certain point. Yeah. And trust me, um, I know we have interior or deco companies in Uganda. Yeah, definitely. But uh, I do not feel aesthetics, like eh? you love seeing things look nice in spaces and, uh, and Okay, stuff. let me let me tell you this. Uh I do not think Yeah. Oh, I've not seen the best yet around here yeah so you'll be the, we are not well represented we are not given the best mm -hmm. and if i had that unlimited supply of money because you know in life it's about try and error yeah. well, of course the smart way mm -hmm. okay i would make sure i give uganda the best in that sector yeah man me it's very easy the best me it's very easy to so avoid having funny stages for example for concerts unlimited okay? money Yes, that means nice. we're having roll and roll and roll and roll on. Yeah. Because you know one thing about interior, it changes. Every yeah. season comes with a new wave. Yeah. Okay? But if I'm giving you the best, I'm putting it to the next level. Mm -hmm. Just interior or all design? All design. That's Studio, nice. hotels, a yeah. Airbnb, people's houses. <laughs> Uh, concert stages, weddings, parties. You know, interior is broad. Uh, have you been to Tuwayo Market Day? Yes, have of course. Have you seen the, the, uh, the design? I'm, I'm telling you. Yo. I got my product yeah. today and the uh -huh. next day as, as a Tuwayo, as a vendor. Yeah. That was like my start. That was my first sale at the Tuwayo Market. I'll uh -huh. talk about that someday. Yeah. How it felt and how it went. Um. But yeah, that's my journey in business. I have nothing to talk about. Okay, it's nothing much I can say about business because I've not been there. Mm. Probably I'm praying next year by this time, I'll be here to talk about the one year anniversary and how it all went down. So yeah. let's keep thumbs up. I mean, if, if I had to answer your question, if you asked me that question, mm. unlimited money. Mm. First, I know anybody that has unlimited money is very impulsive, mm. right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, you can ask anybody in this room, if you had unlimited money, Nick would have all the machines he needs, mm -hmm. you know. Pretty sure my guy would would own all the coffee in the world. All the coffee machines, <laughs> you know. Yeah. You'd have like the biggest production studio in the mm -hmm. country, right? Yeah. And my guy here, same. You guys, same thing, right? Because production means both, you yeah. know, visual and audio. Me, <laughs> mm -hmm. I'd be very impulsive. Unlimited money, bro. Yeah. I'm going to buy Man United. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm bringing back Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm doing with unlimited money. Because I believe Man United is a business that can sustain me Forever. from generation to generation. So, yeah, I get Man United, Ronaldo, Mbappe, same team, and I'll be happy. If I was to act on happy. impulse... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if I start with impulse, yeah. I think I would buy Twitter still. You'd buy Twitter. And take down Elon Musk's blue badge for a day just to punish him. You and know Elon uh, Musk is smart. <laughs> He's really smart. He's like, what's the most influential thing in the in the world right now? Twitter. Yeah. So how do I be the most influential person in the world? Buying, it. Buying Twitter. So what? that's what I would do. I take away his badge and take him through that yeah. phase of asking for his badge back. And then I give him terms and conditions apply. Yeah. Period. That's it. Did he take away your badge? <laughs> <laughs> ah, we shall talk about that next time. <laughs> All right. Okay. Next question. Let's go. Right. All right. 
How many relationships have you ever been in your whole life? Don't talk about situationships. Don't talk about hit ups. Only the relationships that you, you feel guys counted. Should have warned me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you guys should have warned me. Okay, we shall talk about that behind the bars. Yeah. Okay, let me shoot the question. It's cool. It's cool. <laughs> Tell me how you handled the last breakup you had mm. in your past relationship. In my past relationship. Yep. <laughs> Please don't tell me that you've not had any. You guys Because I believe you've had trap. them. This tell right me. Here is a trap. How I handled it, you know. I spoke to the person, you know. And Did I, you I, break I, up? They, they this, broke this, you this up. This is the this is the first thing. They I, broke I, you I, up. How they I handled up. it. I wanted to understand, you know. And <laughs> <laughs> you're avoiding that. Did, Did you I, break or they broke you? Uh, mm -hmm. I wouldn't say I was broken. They broke you. You broke it. I you ended it. I ended. The, it was like a situation ship. You know. Okay. Cool. Uh -huh. Okay. The last. If I'm um, to answer your question correctly, <laughs> away from situation ships or whatever, mm -hmm, and it's mm -hmm, just a relationship. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I broke somebody's heart. Yeah. You know. Bad boys. Yeah. Mm. I did. <laughs> I'm not a bad boy. <laughs> then this is this is the thing that I also understood with all of this, uh, trying to understand people don't, it's not because people do bad things to you that they are bad people. Mm. You know, everybody has their own life, right? Mm. Everybody is the star in their life, you yeah. know? Your life is like a movie. We all have to live. You have to be the main character in your movie, right? So you're only going to do what's good for you, right? So yeah, man, that's that's how I look at it, that's and that's why that's what made me understand. Someone says someone's gonna all hurt humans you, are selfish exactly. at a certain point because exactly. at a certain point you have to think about you first. Yeah, and that's it because you're here. So that's Zoe. how you handled it. That's your name. That how I handled it. <laughs> I just wanted to understand. You know, <laughs> I actually thought when your heart is broken, mm. you, it hurts more mm. than when you break someone's heart, brother. When you break it's it. It's different. When you break someone's heart that you actually care about. Love. Mm. You know? Mm. Bruh. You know, living with yourself. That's you know, you can, you can tell the other person, this is what I did. You know? <laughs> but then living with yourself, going to bed, knowing that, eh, this is what I did to someone I actually care enough. You know? Mm. Makes you feel like you're a monster. Like, you, you know? Every Friday, you're having a flashback, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Every Friday. Friday. Okay. Even I hope Mondays. you get through that. Yeah. Sending no, no, prayers. No, I'm good guys. now. I'm good. Perfecto. Mm, 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 nice. Mm, mm. Bruv. Okay. I am kawa. <laughs> I can't complain. Make sure you put this one in there. Eh? <laughs> Cause you guys, man, you stop it there, man. He's and someone kawa, come for he's me, kawa, bro. <laughs> he's kawa. He's not going through a heartbreak. <laughs> yeah. I'm good. That's official. I'm good. Mm hmm. Ah, what is at the top of your bucket list? Yeah, what's at the top of your bucket list? What's that one thing you want to do? At the top of the bucket list. Number one. I want to travel the whole world. Jeez. So help me God. Period. In life, you need to be delusional. That way, you can be happy. <laughs> it's not being delusional. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like you have to be happy. I mean, if Nyaka was not delusional, he wouldn't be where he's at right now. Mm -hmm. You know, aim for the highest level. Yeah, yeah. And then at least if you drop on fourth position, you're going to the Champions League. Yeah. That's a nice wish, thing, right? I only wish So if you at way. least go to all the continents, mm. you've traveled the world. Yeah. You know, you don't have to go to every country to I travel. I only wish the world. there was a way we could enjoy travel without going through the hassles of visa, mania yeah. this, mania I mean, that. Who created visas, man? Yeah, but. You to get an American passport or <laughs> European passport you want to get. But still, the, For process, real? the process of so getting. Americans get can go anywhere. Yeah. And you confirm if you want to disappear or not. 
Yeah, they have to look through your financial <laughs> statements. <laughs> they ask you questions like, can you finance yourself further? Can you do this when I'm returning? They want to make sure you have a stable job back home so that you'll be able to get back. Yeah. You'll find people pretending to be married just to go abroad. Yeah. Like, okay. So that's how you know I don't that's have a passport. That's our whole topic. <laughs> I hope one day we sit down here and talk about the things people do and go through. Yeah, we need to talk about how it's hard to we get need a passport. To talk. You know. Someone will go and and put in all the money they have and they do not get this and visa at the end of the day. Then depression Brr. and everything that follows. Yeah, but if I People didn't People get have depressed chance, because they haven't gotten visas. Yes. This is someone who has sold the family land. Ish. Someone has given in everything to go abroad and then they fail to go. They do not know where to go. They do not know what to do. Hey. Yeah, so that's it. I would travel the whole world if I had... I mean, oh, if why, I why would you want to leave Uganda, man? This is the uh, pearl of the motherland. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know? tell, tell us more about the pearl. <laughs> this is the pearl of the motherland. Okay. Yeah, like we told you, we're vibesing, and you know we got the vibes in. My name's Chimp, mm-hmm. and I'm with Zoe, and this is We Need to Talk. Don't forget to go and subscribe to the YouTube channel, Gather Now Network. Go tell a friend, tell a friend that we are here and we ain't going nowhere, Mm -hmm. you know? So if you just want to listen to us, maybe you're in the car, maybe you're doing laundry for those that do that, right? You could be in the gym. You could be in the gym, you know? And you just want to listen to Zoe's, you know? You know, Zoe has those words, eh? (laughs) (laughs) And you just want to listen to them. Like, for example, which ones? I mean, you were here telling me about how you're an accountant and how to save and how to do all of these good things, you know, and how to hit the gym, how to get the gym body. Trust me, you You know, not listen to half of it yet. Not even a quarter, not even even an inch. Yeah, Yeah. so you want to listen to us? We're on Anchor, we're on Spotify, we're on uh, Podcasts by Apple, we are on iHeart and all the major podcast streaming services remember to subscribe share with a friend Mm. move those links around like it's a movement because we need to talk yeah man we need to talk talking mental health talking fitness training talking finance we're talking everything that you need to talk about about love and coffee love man (laughs) relationships and that bro (laughs) so yeah i have a mad question here eh? Mm, should i be scared Uh, um tomato tomato I'm ready. Are you more of a work to live type of person rather than live to work? Work to live. Do you work to live? <sighs> or live uh, to work. Work to live. Work to live. To work. So you work to live. Do I work to live or do I live to work? Yeah. Uh, I should say it's a complex and complicated question. It needs a lot of breakdown and all yeah. that, but I'll jump right on to the question, sorry, the answer, and say I'm not any of the two. You're not any of the two? Yeah. Ish, explain. First I'm of all, you. when you say, uh, do I work to live? Work that to that live. means... That means I wake up every morning to go hustle so that I could afford life. Yeah, so you can live life. Yes. And feel alive. Yeah. <laughs> okay, not for long. Maybe yeah. for a while, like yeah. four or five months. Or I could afford to live without working yeah. for a period of time. So or that means Are you that guy? Who wakes that, up to that just work? Walks. No, lives to work. Um, those are workholics, I should say. Yeah, Tommy and Shelby, demons. At a certain point, I would love to be that kind of guy, but yeah. sometimes the stress is above it all. I'm that kind of person who will not hesitate to leave a workplace or a job if it's stressing me. Mm. Instantly. Mm. I mean, it gets to you, man. I mm. feel like all of us have had that time where you you live to work. So, you know? Like if you're working on a project, you're fully must. In whatever mm. you're doing, yeah. For for example, creatives, you know, pretty sure Nyaika has done something like this, where or Ao or even Amon, you know, where you, even Edgar, you're like in a proper project, it becomes part and parcel of you. Maybe you're in Northern Uganda shooting a documentary. Mm-hmm. You need to, to actually, in. you know, you need to leave. The most important, <laughs> the most important <laughs> thing about this because it could be a war area, mm. you know, and Bro, you need to live to work, bro. You need to wake up and be like, ah, I woke up. <laughs> Let's go work. 
When, you know? when, when we speak about that, I believe most people who are probably tied or who are doing what they are doing, um, okay, the people who do it just for survival, yeah. but there are people who do it because they love it and they yeah. enjoy it. So regardless of the situation, whether it's a war zone, whether it's, um, I do not know whether it's raining cats and dogs, just yeah. as we move to come here today because we enjoy and we love to be here or to do whatever we're doing at the mm-hmm. moment. Um in that kind of phase, maybe that's how I would say uh, that's someone like you can leaving find to life work. In work. Mm-hmm. You so can find life in work. Yeah, that's the leaving to work probably. And maybe I mean, I like can, the I Kardashians, can, man. Yeah, they live to work. They maybe to I work. can lie you a just little wake bit up, on that. Drink coffee. Someone's recording you. But that's not work. You go They're to the gym. To chill. Someone's They're recording you. They're living to relax. They're living to enjoy. Yeah. Hmm. So. If that if you're living to work, you must be enjoying your work. I mean, Otherwise, I don't know if I it's Jim know. Carrey that said. At a certain uh, point, it's like living to suffer, but <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to say that. Yeah, I don't know if it's Jim Carrey that said you rather do what gives your soul fire, what puts your soul on fire, mm-hmm. than doing what doesn't. Because at the end of the day, you're going to find adversity in both of them. Mm. So if you're doing something you know re- you never really wanted to do in the first place, it's still going to stress you. Even the one that you live and want to do, like you wake up and you're like, ah, I get to do this. It's still going to stress you. Mm. There's still adversity. So, yeah, I believe uh, I was a live to work guy, you know. Now I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I want to live, mm. you know. Yeah. One time. Okay. That has been an interesting session, Mark. Mad, mad. I believe All I now know. Man. I know something about you. Yeah. I know that you broke up with someone and then you healed. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Zoe's <What>? takeaway is <laughs> mad. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And yeah. I know that we need to talk. Yeah, we need to talk. Often, man. actually. So. We need to talk. All right. So it's been real. Chimp, Zoe. We need to talk. You know, you can find us on our YouTube channel, Gather Now Network. You know, subscribe, like, share, leave a comment behind. Tell us what you guys want to hear from us the next time we come here to do this pod. You know, we live for this. I mean, I live for this, you know. (laughs) And don't forget, we're talking about mental health. We're talking about financial literacy. We are talking about life, you know, of a huge man, you know, (laughs) out here in Kampala, Uganda. You know, it probably affects everybody else, you know. So if you're in the diaspora, you like our content, you know, share with a friend. Yeah, man. You can always find us on our social media channels. Mm -hmm. We have an Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook as well, you know. And if you just really want to listen to us, you're in the gym, working out, or you're doing laundry. I don't know why I keep on saying (laughs) that one. eh? But yeah, man, I do my own laundry. That's why I'm like, hey. Yeah. Mm. So you're doing your laundry, you just want to listen to a podcast. It's always good to do your own laundry because never know sometimes. Yeah, man. Yeah. You're doing your, 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 your laundry and you just want to listen to a podcast. Mm. So we're on Anchor, we're on Spotify. You can find us on a podcast by Apple. Yeah. You can find us on iHeartRadio, right? And all the major podcast uh, platforms. Yeah, it's been real. Till next time. I can't you know? <laughs> wait for the next session. It's Trust me, this has been up. amazing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can't wait for the uh, next we love one. It. We love we it. We love you. Keep waiting for the next one. Do not switch it off. Keep waiting for the content. <laughs> <laughs>